Mama and her babies. Here comes my boat in my dreams. There goes my boat. Here's a little island off the uh, New River, and it's called Little Florida because it looks like the state of Florida. Going around the back side of this island called Little Florida. Can we get a paddleboard? Osprey at the top of the tree. Oh, oh. This is the world famous Fort Lauderdale Jungle Queen. It's doing the loop like we are on the boat. Get a little po po action on the waterways. Yeah. This is where the big boats come to get repaired. You know, boat stands for bring on another thousand. Well, in this case, I'm sure it's bring on another hundred thousand. Can you say wax on? Wax off. Now that's a big job. I wonder how often they wax it. We're going under I-95 and we've got bridge workers. Um, how would you like this job? And it's like a huge, like billion dollar project. I learned about it in real estate course. Wow. City's got to have one. Fort Lauderdale? Oh, yeah. That's where all the monkeys are. Did oh, you? That's did another you plane. See? I love planes. There's a photo of a monkey. The mama and the three babies. This is the Rustic Inn. It's a um, restaurant that's been in the Fort Lauderdale area for years. They're known for their crabs. It's gotten to be pricey, but. Uh, it's nostalgia. More big yachts in another place. Oh, look at that. It's like a little submarine, Danielle. How orange thing? Aww. She go in there. We got a little yellow, uh, orange submarine up here. That big boat. How they mash that thing off. Great heron over there. That's right. Going by the Euro Dam in Holland, America. Sunday afternoon. They get ready to go out here shortly. Out in Port Everglades. That's a celebrity. Those are nice rooms on the back of the uh, boat. Nice big state rooms. Here's the Laurel of the Seas. I believe it's to be the largest ship right now. If not, it's the second largest ship. Okay. 
Now that's the pink boat, the Foxy. Fort Lauderdale Beach is on the other side of those buildings. In the intercoastal. Pretty cool house at a point. It brings you from one end to another. We are on the New River still. We're actually doing a real big loop around the city. Not quite Venice, but it's what we got here. Party boat! We're having a good time on that little party boat. And we got here one for sale. Any takers? Give me a call. This is where you come to get picked up by the taxi. People waiting for the next ride. Almost looks like a church. Happy dog. It's so cute. Big pandas up here on the river. These are all newer built. This is the Stranding Inn house where the Seminoles came and traded all their goods along the river many, many years ago. It's now a museum. This is the new uh, river landings. The hotel, the um, it's a condominium complex, and the pool is way up there on the rooftop. This is the young hip building here, New River Landings. It's all young professionals. Young professionals, real hip kind of place to live here. And, Fort Lauderdale area. Of course, anyone can live there. If you have money. It's good to be a criminal here in Fort Lauderdale because this is our jail. Built a few years ago. I wonder what it takes to get a window view. And then behind it's a new courthouse being built. All along the river. Okay, now you feel like you're in Venice. Okay. Gondolas. Over here to the right, we've got um, the river walk. And then on this side is the uh, down under saloon that's been around a long time. That was a restaurant along the river front. A little bit of an Irish bar. We'll be rocking here in a week or in a couple weeks. This is the old short shirt tailed Charlie's is now Pirate Republic Bar. Straight ahead is the Theater Performing Arts here in downtown Fort Lauderdale. Oh no, you're um, real appeal. We just pulled the boat out of the water and we saw a floating bottle with a message. And they grabbed it, so let's see what the message says. 
What does the message say? Oh, no, this don't tell me. You are the light of my life. You are my soul, my heart, and my guiding conscious. You pick me up when I'm down and raise me higher when I'm triumph. My love for you is so vast. It could block the sun, but it warms my heart with your light. You are my lover, my confidant, my saving grace, my best friend. If fortune ever separated us, these are the things I would want you to know. I love you. Oh. No I can't right? believe we actually found a message in a bottle. I can't believe somebody write a message to his wife and throw it in the water. What well, was that? He was with his mistress and feeling <laughs> guilty. Well, we're all going to have Good. stories about this one, I guess. Come up with our own conclusions. Do we put it back in? Let's see if we throw it away. All right.